Let me know when you see it. Take two. <laughs> I'm not sure what's happening, guys. I don't know. You're back. You're live from your phone or the computer? You're live on both? Hi, Denise. It doesn't tell you. Uh, okay, the... we're gonna try again, guys. Take two. I don't know what's going on. I don't know why I keep losing signal. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So we're gonna try again. Take two. Sorry, take two. I don't know that one. I wasn't talking to you. <laughs> yeah, let's try again. Yep, take two. Mm -hmm. Hi again. Hello, hello, hello again for the second time, everybody. I see you. Everybody's saying hi on the old live. I see them on the old live too, saying hello. Oh, I only see them. But uh, there's nothing. I, I don't know. We're gonna see if we can get through it. We're gonna see. I'm gonna let a few people jump on before I start showing again. Hello, hello, hello. You guys were not on the other live that was just freezing up. Hello. Because I don't know who was on and who wasn't. Uh, but it was completely freezing on me. So we exited out and tried to do a second live. So we'll see if we can hold people on this live. Talk and show fast. Yeah. Hi, Mary Smith. Hi, Tammy Pitts. Hello again. What? All right. Here we go. I'm going to start showing. Hot mess Monday. Welcome to my life. That has been my day all day today, guys. All day. So this one says, flannels, hayride leaves, s'more sweaters, Back. campfires, pumpkins, bonfires. And then it's got all of those like flowers and pumpkins. It's got like a little tiered tray with cupcakes. And then it says fall. If you lose me again, guys, I don't know if you guys saw this one or not. This was the one I was showing when everything went crazy, crazy. Hi, Ruth. Welcome to the madness. I love this one. This one's cute, guys. Okay, this is a reprint because it went crazy the first time. Hi, Dewey. Ruth, you missed in and out. Yeah, Ruth missed all the drama on the first live. I don't know why it was not holding signal. I don't know what was happening. That did not even go near the trash can. Here's the second go around. Yeah, for a second go around, yep. You have <laughs> oh no, drop no, it was just it wouldn't say connected, mm -hmm. Ruth. It kept going to freezing. Like it wouldn't stay connected at all. And then it made me update Facebook and yeah. Do you sell? I don't sell just prints. No. Hi, Arthreen. I only sell the completed product. You are the glue. Absolutely. Now my stomach's growling. I would search Etsy. 
I don't know if I showed this one or not. So if you guys are just jumping on, these are all for one order. Um, this is what I was working on tonight. So I figured I would jump on and do these with you guys. Um, I know it's tumblers two nights in a row, but at least we're here. Yeah, that one is pretty. The pinks and the oranges together. This is a gorgeous cardinal tumbler, guys. This is really, really pretty. It's definitely very fall looking. That one's pretty, pretty, pretty. First and I must be chopped liver. Not at all. You know, I appreciate each and every one of you guys. I think it's just book a face being a little moody. Why are you covering your face, Pam? What happened? Are we playing peekaboo? That's what I wanted, but I don't like Etsy. What do you mean, Mary? What's what you wanted, but you don't like Etsy? All right, this one is very, very similar to the first, that other one that I showed. Uh, they want to see the Christmas again, please. The Christmas again. Did I show any Christmas? Oh, this one, the gingerbread. And not liver. I hope you guys are not liver. Cardinal. Like, you want a Cardinal's tumbler? Is that what you're saying, Mary? We can do a Cardinal's tumbler. Just send us a message. So these are very similar, but different, if that makes any sense. They're similar, but different. If you guys have any messages, yeah, just definitely send us a message. You can get in contact with us a few different ways. Hi, Sheila. Um... It's not up on the website, Pam. Just send me a message. I can get it up there. These were all for um, an order. These are all for one custom order. So none of these are ones up on the website. But I can definitely get it up there. I don't think Alicia's on here. Otherwise, I would have her do it now. She um, but she said she had a phone call. So I will get it up right after this live. Just send me a message. So I don't forget, guys, because I will squirrel and I will forget. This is two more bluebirds. This one does have the butterfly. I don't know if, no, it's got another butterfly back here. Let's say I thought it had more than one butterfly. Mary, send me a message. So you can either send me a message on Facebook on this page right here, Crazy Craft and Mama. You can go to the website, www.crazycraftandmama.com. Scroll all the way to the bottom and hit contact us. And it'll let you type out a message there. That will come directly to my email. There's also a chat now option on the bottom right hand side of the website. You can click that. That'll send us a chat message. Um, if you do do that, if you if you do use the chat option, please stay online um, because otherwise it'll just respond to you in an email if you um, get off of that chat. Um, or you can just email us at crazycraftamama22 at gmail.com. So there's lots of ways to contact us. Lots and lots of ways. So this one is a leprechaun tumbler. You're very welcome. Hi, Eva. This one has to be Eva. What? Yeah, the top of it. See it? At the top. The back did fine, but not the top. 
Welcome to my Monday. Hi, Sharon. How are you? Um, your dad just sent a message to the business messenger. Can you go look at it? Hi, Jojo. I think Tim's on the other live because he keeps commenting. Yeah, it's it's like at three 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 three. It's kind of cool. He's sending messages to the business messenger. Do you see them? No. Bring me the computer. Or just text your dad and tell him I'm on live. Or call him, either one. Man, I really did mess that up good. I don't know what I did. All right. My honey bun is trying to message me, and I don't know why he's messaging my business messenger. Because he knows you're on live. He could uh, come on the... Did you send him a text message? Um, what were you sending a message about? Uh, Alicia, can you go add this to the website? Uh, mommy says that you were sending a message. Did he say he was commenting on the live? Uh, were you commenting on the live? It's the wrong live, if he was. Are you commenting on the live? Hi, Brenda. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I'm showing this to you. Can you go add this? On the wrong live. It's the gingerbread. Yeah. I don't know if you want to call it like the gingerbread recipe tumbler or something like that, but will you add it? They were wanting a number on this oh, one. Yeah, it's because... I had to start over. Uh, she had to start over. Hi, Laura. But no, I don't need anything. If he's on his way home, I don't need anything. And Unless he has sanity. He could bring some of that home. Hi, JC. Did he hang up on you? <laughs> his dad just hung up on him. Thank you. Guys, she's going to add the... The gingerbread to the website right now. Pam, I think you were the one asking for it, right? Hi, Tim. Right. Sorry, the other live got messed up. Huh? Sorry, sorry. All right, this one says fall, and it says pumpkins, hayride, cider, bonfires, okay. apples, and leaves. It does have, like, an umbrella with leaves underneath. Bring fried chicken so I don't have to cook. Yeah. I am so confused. Sanity, I'll take three cases. Amen, Ruth. She said there's, there's freeze or threes or something on the order board. What? Don't ask me. There's three on the order. What? Or freeze on the order board. He said that? Yeah. Did you ask what he meant? No. Is he still at work or is he on his way home? What? <laughs> Bring me the phone. I said okay. Bring me the phone. I don't know what freeze on the order board. What? He's, on, he's off call now. Well, I'm going to call him back. I don't know <laughs> what that means. We'll have a conversation. I'm not sure what that means. Sorry, guys. What does freeze on the order board mean? What did you tell David? Oh, he didn't understand what you were saying. He's like, there's freeze on the order board. I'm like, order board, what? Somebody just commented on my live. There's all three on the, all threes on the order board. Yes, that's what he meant. Okay, I love you. Bye. Michelle, you're right. That's exactly what he meant. He's like, there's threes on your order. That's exactly what he meant. What? All right. So this one's really, really pretty. Sunflowers. I made pork chops, cheesy potatoes, green bean casserole, and stuffing for dinner. Grandkids were here for dinner. Melissa, can I come over? You love that I'm real, girl. What What do you mean, JC? What does that mean? Hopefully, that's good. I'm a hot mess. I'm I'm just a hot mess. Guys, what you see right here is what you'll see in person. I'm a hot mess. Yes, my order counter is all threes. It does sound like freeze, yep. Yeah, can I be a grandkid tonight? Can I come over? You had Cheerios for dinner? Um, we're going to do, like, 
we're going to fry like pieces of chicken breast and chicken thighs and we're going to do rice a And then David really likes when I take like cream of mushroom soup and um, cream of chicken soup, mostly cream of chicken and with just a tad bit of cream of mushroom and mix them together as like um, a gravy kind of for his chicken. I don't know. Life girl is all good. Yeah, I'm a hot mess. I am guys. I am. I'm sorry. I, I'm a hot mess. Message to, okay, Pam. I'm a hot mess, but that's what, one thing I can promise you guys. If you guys meet me in person, you're going to see the same thing. Hot mess express. It's not even her night to do dishes. She said last night that she was coming. Well, let her do them then. I'm either having count... Mm -hmm. Chocula or boo berry syrup. Count Chocula? I've never even heard of that. Are you unwrapping my tumbler? No, JC. What tumbler do you have ordered? What one do you have ordered? Has it not shipped out? David, look through my orders and see... What one JC has? You made cheeseburgers, simple and quick. That sounds yummy. Frankenberries. Ooh, that sounds yummy. Yeah. I don't eat cornbread. That's one thing I can't eat. You enjoy cooking? Mm, not me. J A C I E. I'm letting it roll. <laughs> He's looking at me like. <laughs> All right. Did I show this? I don't even know if I showed this. This is really pretty. Chocolate cereal with chocolate marshmallows only comes out at Halloween time. I need some. Gnome Winter one you posted on your page. Gnome Winter one. JC, if it hasn't been done, then it will get done tomorrow night. If it hasn't been done. So all open tumblers that are placed before 9 a.m. tomorrow, and I'll say that because um, if a whole bunch of orders come through like during the day tomorrow, they may not get done on tomorrow's night. But so, if it's not done, it will get done tomorrow night. I need a scent so I can send back the shirt I received. Okay, Glenda. And this is a peacock. She said it's the, um, hold on. This, it's this one, right, JC? No, but it's got one on it. Does it have a name on it? No, uh, not that I see. It's that custom for me. She's got a hoodie on. Oh, it's it's on with her hoodie order? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so it just needs to be packed. You hate cooking? I don't mind cooking. I love cooking. I just, I run out of hours in the day, to be 100% honest. I just run out of hours during the day. Um, I love cooking. By the time I, like, cook something for the kids and then get them all dressed and ready for school and off to school, come home, work, leave, go pick everybody else up, Pick everybody up from school, come home, work again, get any homework, any chores, stuff like that done. We just run out of time. I just need like another 10 hours during the day. Don't we all? This one I can do in pink and blue. I have this exact same tumbler in pink and blue. I love this one. I think this is super gorgeous. And I'm telling you now, in person, it's going to look a lot more 3D than what you're seeing on this screen. You're going to love this one, JC. Is my comment coming through? Um, hold on. Let me see if I can scroll back up and see it. Sometimes it lets me and sometimes it doesn't. I don't see any comment here. Okay, Judy, you said you're still trying to get it figured out. I can try and send it from me instead of sending it from Alicia. Um, I don't know that that will change anything. 
Um, the only other thing we can do is cancel the whole order and let you go in and place it again. That would be the only other thing I can think to do. But we'll message you as soon as we get off of here. You need crock pot. I know. I need to be better about using my crock pot, but I'm horrible about it. I am absolutely horrible about it. No, I think all the fun out of cooking. Um, so right now my kids pick the meals and they take turns on who picks the meals for the night. Um, that way they have to help cook, but it doesn't really work that way, to be honest. I work for them. Um, <laughs> David helps cook, but like last night Bryson picked, um, spaghetti. Mom, you didn't take spaghetti home with you. Um, he picked spaghetti last night and it was all done and he came out and he was like, oh, um, I forgot to come help. So, it doesn't always work where they help. Um, all right, let's run back through these again, guys. Just in case you missed any of them, this is the Peacock. If there's any of these that you're interested in, send us a message. Yeah. Absolutely, 100%. I don't know. I have no idea, Judy. I don't understand that. Um, and like Wednesday is going to be a crazy day because Bryson has a fall concert. So he gets home at like 3.30 from school, but he has to be dressed in a tuxedo and back at school for a band concert by 6.30. So in that amount of time, I have to feed him something, get him showered, get him ready, get everybody else ready to be at this band concert and back to the school by 630. But at some point have to do dinner too. So it's, it just, it's crazy with kids. Mm -hmm. uh, what, what is his last one? It's crazy. I'm not picking him up early. This one is up on the website. Alicia just added this one or is in the process of adding this one. This is super cute. It has like a homemade gingerbread cookie. I don't know if that's a real recipe or not, but it's on there. It even says, like, bake at 350 for 8 to 10 minutes. I don't know. It says, the perfect man, he's quiet, he's sweet, and if he gives you any trouble, you can bite his head off. <laughs> Gingerbread spice and everything nice. That's what Christmas is made of. Christmas calories don't count. Gingerbread kisses, Christmas wishes. Gingerbread break, bake, breakery, bakery, always fresh, cake, cookies, and pies, baking spirits, bright, Christmas cookie baking crew. Oh, snap. It's beginning to taste a lot like Christmas. So this is really cute. Pot of chili. That would be quick and easy. This one is bluebirds with like lilac flowers. Yeah, but we need chili dogs. We don't need chili dogs. That's gross. Gross, gross, gross. This one is leprechauns. So these are all for an order. If you are interested in any, send me a message um, and we can get them added to the website for you. I love the double decker. Tomorrow we will have new tumblers because it is Tumblr Tuesday. And all open tumblers will be completed tomorrow night as long as they are in by like 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. This is the birds with the pink flowers. Hi, Mama Mary. Wait a second. Is there four bird tumble? There is. Okay. Ginger recipe. More bluebirds with like 17, pinkish flowers. Seven. Okay, so that gingerbread one is 737. Seven. <laughs> Looks like my husband laughed out loud. Let Dave all make a recipe and see if it's a real one, if it's good or not. That's a good idea, Bridget. It really is. But honestly, I've never had a gingerbread cookie, like a real one, so I don't even know what it would taste like. I've never had a real gingerbread. Have you had a real gin? You haven't either. I was making. Let's whisk it up. But it doesn't table. seem like it's a long enough recipe to make gingerbread. Isn't gingerbread like hard to make? Three fourths cup of softened butter, one cup packed brown sugar, one large egg, three fourths cup molasses, half a tablespoon of cinnamon, half a tablespoon of baking soda, two tablespoons of ginger. Three to four cloves of what? Garlic. I'll say what? Four cups of flour and half and one fourth cup of one fourth 
tablespoon of salt. Bake it 350 for 8 to 10 minutes. So I don't even know. Where can I buy one? Where can you buy what? All the tumblers are at crazycraftandmama.com. Do I have the pink snowman? I do not have the pink snowman, but we can do it tomorrow if you want me to do it. Cloves are a spice. Cloves are a spice. Huh. Okay. Okay. I was thinking like garlic cloves. Does that make sense? Isn't that what they're called? Um, you want to see it's definitely it? not one of your favorite cookies. Ew, that's gingerbread recipe. That's It's on this cup. That's what we were saying. We didn't know if it was a real recipe or not. It's a real recipe. It's a real recipe? That's kind of cool, though. I mean... All right, Ruth, just message me. Leprechaun. They are cute. I 100% agree. They are cute. And, like, we make the gingerbread houses and stuff on the, around the holidays, but I've never eaten one. And I know that's kind of different than, like, a fresh gingerbread cookie, too. Hi, Karen. So if anybody's interested in tumblers, they are all available at crazycraftandmama.com. You can hit type hashtag shop right here in the comments, and that will send you a link in your messenger for my um, website. And if you're not seeing something and you need any help, just send a message right here to this page. Zoe Jane, do you not see that I am on a live? Little girl, get up here and sit down. Then stop. Um, you missed out. Mm -hmm. Can you make a cup with a real recipe? Can you make a cup with a real recipe? Absolutely. I whipped in the green monster looking thing. You put whipped cream in it? See, I don't like whipped, whipped cream. Yep, if you have any questions on anything you can't find on the website, send us a message. Yeah. Um, you can go to the bottom of the website and message yeah. us that way. You can message us through chat now on the website, or you can send us an email. So there's lots of different ways you can message us. Yes. Make sure if you do do a, if you do take a picture of a recipe, make sure it's a clear picture so I can get it the best I can on a tumbler for you. Thank but you that would be a super cool gift. Um, we also do have a few of the cutting boards left, and recipes look really cool on the cutting boards, too. So this one is the birds with the white flowers this one is the floral pumpkin it's got those pink flowers with the pumpkins and the leaves this is those things that won't leave my garage they're back again this year guys they oh, left during the summer month, and they're month, back month, so if you guys have been following me for a while you guys know what I mean these little things are back running around in my garage Yes, that would be. It would be a super cool idea. Absolutely. Huh? Well, they need to find somewhere else for their winter give getaway. Like the outside garage. Send them. No, not rats. Ruth. Chipmunks. Not rats. Wait a second here. Don't be starting no rumors on Facebook about me. Ruth no longer gets the employee of the month for the rest of, like, the next six years. Wow, that's a harsh part. My name is Amber. All right, this one is a hot air balloon. <laughs> wow. On to the next. Ruth said I win. Yeah, I love you too, Ruth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. Ruth says I win. I am home. I'm going to go. Outside You're gonna go outside. Why? No, no thanks. You're gonna come clean up down here because look what my son did with all of these boxes. Mm hmm. Okay, so Sandy, send me a picture. Do you have you have the recipe written out? Oh, babe, come here for a second. Now you gotta go spend time with your mom. Look what I did to my hand. No, I, I think I, I think I got caught in between the couch when I went to pull the couch thing. So you see where it's like cut, but it's like swollen on that vein. I see it. It's bruised. What does that mean? It means you're bruised. Oh, okay. It probably hurts to touch it. It does hurt to touch it. Chewing your wires. 
Don't touch it. It's like right there on that big vein that's in my hand. Those ugly blue things. We have chipmunks digging in our flower beds. They can chew your wiring. They better not chew my wiring. She they need to go somewhere else. She can do the most lovely thing in the world that she loves to do. Hi, Cindy. Icing her hand. I'm not going to ice my hand. Get over it. It's fine. Hi, Lori. Okay, here we go. Sorry, guys. Oh, I, I got distracted. You have all the Plaid pumpkin. They dug through all those boxes to find 20-ounce boxes, and then they stocked my tumbler shelves. But they didn't clean anything when they did it. Could you get mad at them? You put them somewhere safe. Okay, when you do find one, take a picture of it, a good picture with, like, your phone or iPad or whatever. Take a good picture of it. You can send me a picture, and then we'll probably rough up the edges just a little bit, but I'll be able to put just that exact picture on the tumbler. Now, obviously, since you want it in their handwriting, it might be a tad bit blurry. It's not going to be super crisp unless it's, like, really clear, but I think it would look really cool. And if you have, like, more than one recipe, we could put, like, one recipe and then maybe, like, another recipe angled and then another one and then, like, some kind of wording or something. We could make it into something really cool. So definitely um, find them and we'll Chip see what we can do with them. Cute. Chipmunks are cute when they're not in my garage. They're cute when they're not in my garage. Okay, this one is like pumpkins, a moon, and ghost. And that creepy looking thing up there. That's kind of creepy looking. Oh, there's more than one. They're really realistic looking. No thanks. I'm scared of spiders, by the way. It would be a cool wedding gift. The recipes... It, it would be cool. There's a lot of ways you can customize things. Um, talking about like wedding gifts and, um, geez, I got boxes for tumblers everywhere. Babe, I need a space five times bigger. These are really, really cool gifts, especially with like Christmas coming up. So mine says some call it chaos. We call it family. Now, granted, you don't have to put that on there. Um, you could do just like a plain wood background, a plain color background. There's all different ways to do these. Uh, and then these are just family pictures on here. These would be great wedding gifts. You could do like engagement pictures on them, um, family pictures. We've done dog pictures. I mean, they're really, really cool. And you can do all kinds of different examples for these, but they would be great gifts. I'm going to fall because there's even boxes back here. Okay, we'll fix it after the light. No, we. Yes, the recipe cutting boards would be really awesome too. And I would love to show you one, but I have no idea exactly where it's at right now. But we do have the glass cutting boards, and those would be really cool with a recipe on it too. So, like, if you think about it, like, say you have, like, I don't know, a famous pumpkin pie or something that you specifically take somewhere to like Thanksgiving or Christmas, you could make that recipe in like a pan and then take the cutting board, set it on the cutting board and then leave the cutting board for them as a gift for like hosting Thanksgiving or whatever. That's kind of a cool idea too. Oh, babe, the chipmunks chewed all of the wiring out of her brother-in-law's car. They need to go. <sighs> Hi, Barbara. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that would be a really, really cool idea. You could do the same thing with a tumbler um, and do a recipe on that and leave that with them with a recipe on the tumbler. Um, you could do a journal. So you could do a journal like this, um, and it has lined pages. So you could do a journal and put like, I don't know, whatever you want to put on it. So you could put like Hugh Shaw family recipes, um, grandma's favorite recipes or something like that, and then open it up and you could hand write all different recipes in here. 
Um, you could also like Mod Podge them in, like decoupage them into the journal pages with like stickers and fun things. That would be a really cool gift also. Obviously this one has butterflies, but this, I printed it with butterflies. Um, I have plenty of them that are blank that we could print whatever that you wanted on them. It's only $85 for a train to St. Louis. Okay, Sandy, come here and I'll take care of you after your carpal tunnel surgery. I was going to tell you that earlier anyway. You can bring bring the train up here. I'll pick you up and you can come stay here after your surgery. We'll take care of you and we'll keep you very entertained so you won't get bored while you have to stay, sit around. That's Sandy. Yeah, yeah monogram the new name. I'm wearing a butter. After them, I'm hunting chipmunks. I'm hunting chipmunks. Hi, Janice. So these would definitely be a really cool idea. Um, I have all different kinds of plaques. Those would be cool gifts ideas for like weddings and different things like that too. Um, there's tons of options. So if there's anything you guys are thinking, hey, just send me a message and we'll figure it out. Your husband used to hunt down here? Where did he hunt at down here? My daddy used to hunt all the time when I was little. I used to go hunting with my daddy, but he passed away when I was five. Um, but Mama Mary that's on here, her husband and son, my best friend, used to go hunting all the time. Um, his brother Matt goes hunting down here. And then, of course, my hubby used to hunt quite a bit. Not so much anymore, but his dad also hunts too. So it is a big area for that. It definitely is. This t-shirt of the month is back here. It's the maroon one up there. It says, be kind, be brave, be true, be happy, be you. Be kind, be brave, be happy, be true, be you. Around an apple orchard. Huh. I bet that's out my way, really, because all the orchards are right out here. Apple orchard would be what? Flams? You got flams, you got lights, you got latches right over there. And you got... Uh, Hunting around the apple orchard. Um, there's also all those orchards along 127. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's true. And those are tied into plans with the individual orchards. Okay. So, yeah, so that's all right around here. There's a lot of that. There's Cobden, Cobden, Union County. And then there's, there's more of that over that way, too. There's eight more days to get the shirt of the month. Yep, only eight more days for that shirt of the month. All right, guys, so this is all one order. We already got most of, well, I won't say most. We've already got about half of it packed up, so we'll get the rest of these packed up um, after we eat dinner. I am going to head up and cook for the kids um, and get them fed so I can get them to bed so maybe mom can have a quiet night. Ha, ha, ha. That's so funny, right? It's a Christmas movie night. What? It's a Christmas movie night when we pack all these tumblers? So, all right, guys, I hope you guys all have a wonderful night. If you guys have any ideas, any questions, anything like that, definitely send us a message. Me or Alicia will get back to you as soon as possible. Um, I hope you guys all have a great day tomorrow and come back and join us for Tumblr Tuesday tomorrow night. We will have new designs. I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.